Hey everybody, welcome back to the original Resident Evil 3. Um, I noticed that, I'm sure some of you are probably screaming at me in my last video, I, I noticed that I totally went to the substation and uh, I had inventory issues as usual, uh, totally left something over there. There's some kind of fuse item or something like that, so we gotta make a quick trip over to the substation and grab that. I'm not sure what it is used for or what, I'm not even really, it looked like a fuse, I'm not sure what it is, it's probably important, so we're going to make a quick trip back to the substation. We're going to grab that item and then we're going to move forward. We're ready to move past the uh, the point where I put out the fires. Um, I just got to remember where exactly that was. All right, substation. So I need to go at this door right here. We're doing a little bit better. I got the grenade launcher with some explosive rounds. That's definitely been helpful. I think it's the only weapon that I have a lot of ammo for, actually. No, that's right. We restocked. Ooh, that's right. We we had a, a lot of restocking going on. So I've got uh, I'm doing pretty well, actually. I'm doing pretty pretty well. Um, but I'm pretty sure we're about to have to fight something to waste all that anyway. And come through here, and then I believe this is where we need to take the elevator up, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. There to the right. Well, I better better not forget there's also dogs out there on one of the main streets, so I have to be careful with that. And now that I've actually got some ammo, I might go ahead and drop them. All right, now it was in one of the rooms over here. Something else I realized, I think that hallway on the other side only opens if you take the opposite choice. I had a choice between overloading the panel or trying to bust through that door. So I think that's why I can't get in there because I made the choice to overload the electricity to kill all the zombies, which I'm okay with. I don't know if there's any items in there that I'm missing out on, but I don't think I can go in there because I didn't make that choice. Um, no, nothing more. Next room over. Alright, there is definitely something in here I totally forgot. What is this thing? It is a fuse. Okay. I don't know what I need a fuse for, but I think it's going to be important. Alright, now we can head on back to where we were at heading the last time. So, we're now finally ready to make some forward progress. <laughs> the dogs. Yay! That was much easier. Okay. Gonna reload. I did use more shotgun rounds than I would have liked, but at least I can run through here and not have to worry about it anymore. That goes up to the police station, and we don't need to go there. We, yep, right there. So, here we are. We're gonna go this hallway right here. We're gonna go straight across into the new area. Was it the sales office? What the hell was that over here? Sales office. I don't know what's in the sales office. We're gonna find out. Oh, water dripping from the hose. Okay. All right. I have no idea what's over here. Straight hallway. Zombies in there. They're, they're going to be busting out next time I come through here. I could already feel it. Me diving out of that damn window. Oh, I hear that. Yeah, I'll take the crank. Blew something up. Or yet, you, you dick. I hear you. Oh, it's right around that corner. I don't have a good viewpoint on it. Just rushed him. All right. Two shots, two kills. I'm I'm happy with that. We're going to combine, reload. Ooh, what is in the sales office? What are we What are we doing over here? Wait. Hmm. 
What the hell? Oh, hey, it's Murphy. What did you do? I had no choice. He was about to turn into a zombie. It would have been a threat, so I eliminated him. But he was still conscious, wasn't he? He was as good as dead. And it took fewer bullets to kill him now than it would have if he had transformed. Glad to see Nikolai is just as much of a dick here as he is in the, the remake. Uh, so definitely a little bit out of order. Uh, this one, I was surprised to see this uh, very quickly in the in the remake. Uh, it definitely took a while to get here. Not now. I'm busy. Oh, fuck off. Alright, he is rude. Now, I saw something over here. So they've definitely changed up the remake quite a bit from the original. But it's some of the same events still happen. Our manager's report. Before you begin your new position, please allow me to give you some advice. Advice, 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 advice. Some of the medicine in the storage room are unstable and their quality will deteriorate under changing temperatures or humidity. Therefore, you must remember to keep the temperature the same in the storage room at all times. You should personally check it every day. Although the computer checks it around the clock, the machine is not perfect. Try to remember that a machine is no more than a tool to be used by people. You must check all personnel coming and going to the storage room. Many dangerous drugs are stored there, and if any of them are missing, you have a serious problem on your hands. The door to the storage room is always locked, but when you let personnel into it, you will need to have them hand in their documents. And above all else, remember that if you find anything suspicious, contact your boss immediately. What is this place? If you forget the password to lock the door, try to remember that it is a word that everyone is familiar with. Don't forget that once a new product is shipped, the password will be updated again. You can always enter the password from the terminal of the PC for administration. What? Sure. What am I looking at? Safe sprint. So is that the is that the the word the password? Safe sprint. The computer. I don't remember how to f spell it. Hey! Yeah, there was no E. Okay. Oh man, Nikolai is gonna lock me in there. I can feel it. That guy's an asshole. Oh hey, there was something over here. Business facts. Order sheet. The liquid medicine named VTJ98 is suitable to cultivate the NET type virus. Therefore, we will need to order additional quantities of it. UE6 laboratory. VTJ98. Is that important? Any items over here? I don't like this way. Anything here. So I guess we're going in and probably going to have Nikolai lock us in. He is an asshole. This. What's this? Oh, gunpowder. The three of them there? Sure is. Where are they? I can't make anything with it anyway. Uh, A and A. Double A. I don't know what the hell double A does, but we're going to take it. I need this space, so. What is, oh, shit. I don't have enough space. What's triple A do? I can't carry any items. Fudge. Well, we're going to make triple A. I don't know what triple A does, but we take the oil additive. Yes. What do I need all this stuff for? Oil additive. Oh shit. That is a lot of zombies.
Da -da -da -da. Hey, there we go. Alright, we got some more blood there. How many more? Oh, got one more? Is that all? That wasn't too bad. That was a lot of zombies, though. Did Nikolai get killed? Surely not. That was an, there's no way that dude died an off-screen death. There's no way. I'm pretty sure he comes important later. Woo. There's definitely a lot of zombies in here. One of those guys is not dead, either. Ooh. Okay, that freed up a spot. Oh, that freed up a spot. That's actually good news. It's actually great news. I can go back and go whatever that item is. Alright. I actually think... Damn it. Well, we're in less... Oh, shit! I didn't know you were over there! Alright, she's dead now. Too bad it's broken. Oh, what's this? First aid spray. Well then, I hope I didn't screw up by grabbing all those freaking powders and making A, because I think that makes... handgun ammo. And I don't want to use handgun ammo at this point. So I might have wasted that. Wait, I did get it. Okay, never mind. I need to check. What does AAA ammo do? Well, we just get out of here. The hell is the point of coming over here? Thought I heard something. It's not dead. We're gonna ignore. I don't want to waste any more ammo than I already have there. I use a lot of shotgun and grenade launcher rounds there, unfortunately. Also kind of hurt. What the hell was the point of coming over here? I should have just left the damn gunpowder on the shelf. There's a safe room right through this hallway. Yeah, they're gonna bust out. Maybe not. Maybe not. I could have swore they were gonna jump out of the windows, but apparently not. So I guess now maybe I need to go to the trolley. I don't quite remember how the hell to get there. I think it's back in the area we were just at, so. Get in the safe room. Let's get in the safe room. Okay. I knew he was gonna be back sooner or later. Holy shit. He's got that bazooka. Yeah, it's playing the crazy music. Alright, so we got a lot of parts here. I don't remember what any of these things are for. We got a crank. We have machine oil. We have oil additive. Oh, I got a lot of first aid sprays. So I'll probably go ahead and use that one. Grab that too. 
and a fuse. I still don't know what the fuse is for, either. Do we have any other powders? It does not look like we have any other powders. Well, real quick, let's go ahead and save, just because I know he's right outside. I'm running low on ribbons too, holy shit. Well, oh, I almost forgot, I almost forgot. And I guess just because, I know we don't have the ammo for it, but let's just grab that, could come in handy. And do I have the Magnum equipped right now? I do. All right. I need to go left, I think. Oh shit! He was winding up. All right, he's not gonna chase me until I get past the screen. I need to go right and then left. All right, because here it comes. Woo. I'm ignoring them right now. I don't want to waste any ammo because I'm kind of low. I could probably drop them. Although, honestly, I could probably take them in this area here. It's probably a mistake. Let's find out. I ran right into that. That was a mistake. Well, that was a mistake. I'm glad I saved. Uh, I am not good at fighting this guy. I think you gotta rely on those dodges, but the dodges are just so tricky in this game. I think taking them on right there is probably a bad idea, so I'm just gonna, we're gonna run this time. Because it takes a lot of shots to take this guy on. And I'm not good at dodging. I've got a little better there. I dodged a couple things here and there, but not enough, not enough. Woo. I still don't know where I'm going. Ooh, okay. Let's get a little bearing. Let's get our bearings real quick. All right, straight. Open. Okay. We need to go left, straight down. Oh, he's definitely after us! Holy shit, okay, this is where the birds are. I gotta run anyway, so I'm gonna take a right in the parking garage. I heard him say stars, but did he chase us there? I don't think he stopped chasing us. What the hell's happening now? Oh shit. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. We're gonna try to climb up. I d don't know what the hell was the point of that. We dodged it at least, but holy shit.
All right, I would like to save here. However, I only have like two ribbons left, so we're gonna we're gonna skip and move on. I think he's done chasing us anyway. I'm not entirely sure where we're supposed to go. I'm I'm head back to where the trolley is, which I think is over here. So I need to go straight, right, left. We'll get there. Yeah, it definitely seems like he stopped following, so I th I'm kind of happy with that. At the same time, I wish I could get better at killing the dude, but it takes so many shots. I'm gonna go left here? Yeah. Another left. All right, here we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Um, shit, I forgot the birds were there. All right, moving on. And where was the trolley from here? All right, left. Except. Oh, I got him. I got him stuck. Oh, maybe not. Oh, don't kill me. I probably use it too early. Damn it. What? Oh my god, okay. I'll take that. What parts B? Bad, I went through a shit ton of mag ammo for that. I'm gonna hold off, I'm gonna hold off. Maybe if I combine the parts, it's the new Desert Eagle pistol. I can put the ammo for that instead. But man, it took forever to get that much mag ammo and just burn through it so quick. Am I in the right place? I am. I have to be, because he's definitely... He forced us to confront him there. What the hell was that? Oh, I want that green herb. Damn it, I'm not gonna get the green herb. You sons of bitches. Oh, we're in the sewers now. Oh, shit.
Shit, I think I missed. The terrible angle. God dang it. I don't have any healing, do I? Shit balls. What am I supposed to do here? I'm not gonna be fast enough, this gonna kill me. Give me shit. Oh, damn it. Well, poop. All right, then. So that didn't go well at all. So I, I lost some progress, but it's just me running the hell away from Nemesis for a long time. Instead of grabbing the pistol, which I don't think it's going to do me any damn good anyway. We are going to grab some healing. I think I'm gonna need the heals. Um, holy crap. This section sucks. I'm gonna grab one more just to be safe. Hopefully I won't need it. We're still gonna try to run from Nemesis. I'm gonna try to run past him once he uh, heads us off over by the capital. Uh, what is it? The Whatever the hell that one be. Oh shit, I gotta go. Yeah, we're gonna keep running from him until he stops chasing us, and once he shows back up, we're gonna try to get around him in that tight hallway. I, I don't know if it's possible, but we're gonna try. I don't want to spend a lot of freaking ammo trying to kill this guy. Although, we do get the parts B. I just... Man. Oh, no you don't. No you don't, sir. Not today. Shit. Okay. Woo. He's fast. Oh, birds. I think this is where he stops chasing us. Right here. Alright. So we are free for the time being. Thankfully, I'm not that far behind. No. Oh, that's right. I'm going to drop down this time. I'm going to see what happens. Last time we climbed up, we dodged the boxes. I'm going to see what jump off does. Because there might be some items or something. Or maybe it takes us straight to the sewers anyway. So I'm just curious to... Curious to what the other decision does. Udo! Jump off. Better move. Okay. That did put us in the sewers. A little bit different. What the fuck is that? Oh, what the hell? Leeches. Well, shit. Where does this ladder go? Right, freaking here. Well, there's much, not much difference there other than you have to deal with the freaking leeches. Did it hurt me? I'm still fine. But no, I guess if we die, we're gonna stick with climb up because I don't want to deal with the leeches. Leeches are gross. Was there something in that car? Maybe not. I can't see it. Okay. Damn it, I wish I was not running low on ink ribbons.
There was a substation. We're not going to substation. We're going this way. So just a refresher why I'm concerned about dealing with Nemesis is the dodge in this game is not, there's no dodge button. There's no dedicated dodge button. Essentially, you have to be already aiming, which is holding down R1. And then as soon as, well, it's essentially the same thing as shooting. It's R1 plus X. So you have to time it. So as soon as the swing is about to hit you, that's when you hit X. Is it's almost kind of like a parry almost in Dark Souls. The timing has to be perfect. And as soon as you hit that exact moment, she'll dodge instead of shoot. It's very, very tricky. I'm not good at it, obviously. All right, this is where Ombre shows up. I got lucky last time I got stuck. Damn it. Woo! I got around him. Hooray me! Woo! Okay, I don't know if he keeps chasing. I don't know if he keeps chasing, but at least I managed to get out of there and uh, maintain our ammo, because that's... That's positive, because now I can deal with the freaking slug in the sewers. I did take a hit there. You gonna chase me after this? Doesn't like it. I probably could have killed him there and got the eagle part speed, but I just don't. I'm not confident. Freaking worm. Can I grab this? Let me grab it. Yes. Okay. Thank goodness. Yay. That makes me feel better. <coughs> Woo. All right. Now we can deal with the worm. We've actually got ammo and such. Hopefully take on the worm. I don't, I'll keep the magnum out. I think I know how to take on the worm. I got plenty of healing supplies. I like how she just inspects the wall. Ooh, that was weird. I assume I'm doing okay. I, I, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do here. Not that. I just got myself killed like an idiot. Oh, I... I didn't... I kept running forward, and I gotta hold down and back away. So, can this thing even be killed? That's my next question, because holy crap. Alright, here we go. We're back again. Grab this green herb real quick. Um, I took a couple hits from Nemesis trying to get here, but um, I, I noticed last time I died that there was a panel in there. And I think what I've got to do is book it for the panel and press a button real quick. And I'm hoping, hoping that's going to drop the ladder so I can get out of there. Because uh, I dumped a whole click up of the map. I put six rounds with the Magnum um, into that worm last time, and it didn't even seem to phase it at. So I don't know if I'm supposed to shoot it. I'm going to try to get out of here first, and we'll see how that works. Surprise. Oh, oh. There's two of them. Oh, not today. Heal up. Did that do it? Oh shit! Son of a bitch. This dude's a dick! Yes! What a terrible, terrible design. I. 
Maybe I could have killed him. I don't know. I, I I have plenty of healing supplies. I almost would rather. Oh, what is this? Ooh, shotgun shells. Yes, please. A lot of shotgun shells too. Where the hell am I? At the trolley. Where I wanted to go anyway. But anyway, I th I'd rather use the healing supplies. I have a lot of healing supplies and not as much ammo, so I'll I'll take that hit. All right, let's say hi to the guys. Holy crap. Yeah, he's in bad shape. He's definitely worse shape in this game than he is in the remake. The remake is actually up. Oh, wait. Mechanics memo. I know that you're intimidated by your new job, Kevin. Kevin. So let me tell you how to make sure that you and your trains get along just fine. You see, these two carriages were made in 1968 and then imported from Europe. Sometimes they get rickety, but they still work because they are simple, stubborn, and strong. We can always depend on them. If they have a bad day and are malfunctioning, you'll need to take a good look at their circuits for any trouble. Once you discover what's wrong, you'll be able to fix it easily. I'm sure that you'll be able to avoid those nasty little malfunctions if you check the parts every day. These old trains will surely have problems if you don't remember to check them out. Just remember, if you need to replace anything, you have to choose a suitable part. Parts. When I say suitable, I mean that even if you can't find another original part, you better find something that works good enough. Even with regard to oil, you must always prepare good quality oil for these trains. Never forget, Kevin, that a man may betray others, but a machine won't. So we got to diagnose what's wrong. Uh, this is where we need all the parts. We need a fuse. We need oil. And we need the... That's where we need all the parts. The power cable is disconnected. The fuse is broken. The mixed oil. So... I need all that stuff. Shit. That's what I need all this stuff for. So I had to go back to a save room to get it. Okay. Here we go. This is where our save room was. Ooh, stressful. This is so stressful. All right, so before we do anything, let's grab the the mixed oil. So we need machine oil and oil additives. And then we're going to grab the fuse. We're going to combine these guys. Mixed oil. And then now we need the wire. I don't know what the crank is going to be for, but we're going to grab that too. I don't think I'm going to need to crank, but just in case. Okay. Now. I really want to save. I only have two ribbons left. I'm hoping to get past this little section here and we'll loot some more. And keep on trucking. All right. We got everything we need so far. I think now we just need to repair this trolley and get the hell out of here. I don't know if it's going to do anything to the fire. I don't know if it's supposed to do something about that, but... Uh, where was the panel? Is it on this side? No, I think we're going the opposite direction from the fire. Well, we got the fuse, we got the cable, and we got the oil, so let's repair this bad boy. That the order needs to be in? Parts seem to be out of order. No, so I don't think it matters. Um, the oil in. Be green, let's put the cable on. What you lock up on me? Power cable on. And the fuse. Glad we, I realized that I left the fuse back there because we definitely need the fuse. It looks Carlos? like we're ready to go. Here, take this. What are you giving me, Carlos? Play rounds. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Nikolai won't be joining us. I understand. I'll operate the cable car. Let's go. And Nikolai ain't dead. This is too quiet. It's making me very nervous. Is this a boss fight coming up? I 
It's looking good. So far, so good. Is anything gonna happen? It definitely didn't go well in the remake. Oh, there we go. Mikhail. Hey, what's going on in the back? Let's go check out. Oh, I know what it is. It's probably Nemesis. 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 Mikhail. Yep. Damn it. That grab sucks. I don't know if I have enough healing supplies for this. Damn it! Don't get off the ground. Shit. Oh, sh no, don't dial me. No. Get up. Alright, real quick. I better plug in my controller before it dies. Okay. I think I got it. Alright. Ooh, that was a close call. Alright, how am I doing? Caution. Not. Oh, God. He's got me trapped in a corner. Damn it. Shit. He's not done yet. He's not done yet. Chith, get out of the cable car now. Mihail, wait, don't. Get out of here. Hurry. Okay. Oh, blew his ass out of them trolley car. Well, Mikhail. here goes Mikhail. No, the brakes. Uh oh. Are what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Try the window. Use the emergency brake. Try the emergency brake. Uh. Oh, that apparently didn't work. Holy crap. Oh, we survived at least. Damn, trolley car went crazy. I don't know what happened if we would have jumped. I don't know where Carlos is. And crows. Oh, this is the clock tower we saw in the photo. Probably run. I don't know where I was going. I was just running for the nearest door. Where the hell are we now? <clears throat> oh, there's a piano. Locked the clock is etched under the keyhole. So we need a clock key. This door's unlocked. Where are we going? What's happening here? 
Hey, save room. I need to find some damn ink ribbons. There's got to be some ink ribbons in here somewhere. It's holy crap. Something right there, sparkly. Altar. What's this? Oh, it's the clock tower key. Why does it have a slot in it? Hold on, let's check that bad boy. Ornamented. It's a key ornamented with a clock part. It has a screw shaped ornament to put a round shaped object. Okay. What the hell? What the hell was that? Oh, there's not any ink herbs in here. Crap. Oh, well, th this is a good stopping point. This, uh, this episode was definitely stressful. Uh, a lot of, a lot of dying and learning. I was hoping as I continued on through the game that I would find some more ink ribbons, but now I'm down to my very last one, which makes me incredibly nervous. Also, something just smashed the ceiling in this save room, but I have no idea what it is. I don't remember what we have to deal with here, but I think maybe hunters. But we're going to definitely save that for the next episode. If you like this video, smash that like button below, and then leave a comment and tell me what other PS1 games you'd like to see me play. And as always, stay healthy, stay safe, and take care. Bye-bye.